Hey there guys, today I'm back with the first Christmas recipe. So there will be 23 more, but let's get started. You want to start out with an apple and you want to cut it down into uh, um, quarters basically and then just remove the middle part and then you can throw it into your pan. And you can see I had wounded my finger, so I'm a little bit clumsy in this video, I'm sorry. Next up, you want to peel two um, little clementines and then cut them into half. And you want to cut it in a way that the juice can come out into your mulled wine, actually. Then just throw it in there as well. Last but not least, you want to cut down some ginger. And you want to peel it as well, cut it into smaller chunks and put it in your pan. Now it's time to add the cranberry juice and then your star anise and then some cinnamon and some cardamom. And this is what it looks like. Now you want to bring it to a boil. And when it boils nicely, you want to reduce the heat to a very low and you want to add in your wine. And then you want to let that sit for about 30 minutes, but you do not want this to boil again. So make sure of that. It's a very, very low heat now. And then you're ready to remove all of the fruit and then you can pour it into a bottle and store it and enjoy it. So yeah, I hope you try this. I love doing my own mulled wine. <laughs> you might use a little bit of honey with this as well because this is not very sweet, but I like mine to be a little bit more sour. So just do it the way you like it and have a great Christmas time and until tomorrow. Bye.